One of the things in this class, um, and I think in art history more broadly, is that when looking at the artworks that we had at hand, uh, we were pushed to think, what does the artwork really want from me? Uh, because oftentimes we're thrown into some situations where we say, well, this is this class and this is this artwork, so this is what I'm going to talk about it, period. But we don't stop enough to realize that sometimes the artwork requires certain levels of engagement with it. And so uh, in my case, uh, for the first assignment, I picked the Statue of St. Joseph and the Christ Child, which obviously requires some discussion of religion. And what I've seen in art history classes is that no matter how religious the subject might be, we tend to shy away from talking about it um, because it's old, because it's uncomfortable, because we're in Quebec and it's a secular society and whatnot. Uh, but sometimes you have no choice but to talk about religion. Um, and the second set of images that I chose were photographs from uh, the 1960s. And the research that I found in the archives made no mention of religion, even though they were explicitly about religious rituals like First Communion and Catechism. And so that's when you have to stop and say, maybe these photographs want me to talk about religion. And I think that's where my background in religion came in handy to contextualize and really understand what was going on with these photographs.